She's been asleep between my ankles for about an hour. And poor thing, I keep coughing and jostling her. She just woke up and she crawled over there off my chair. And she's been mean mugging me, making eye contact. And I have to keep telling her. <coughs> it's not time. That's the only reason why she's awake. Is she keeps staring me in my eye. Because she's hoping it's time. It's not time. But it is time for Aunt Sarah to take her second dose of antibiotic of the day. And because it makes you so dizzy, it tells you, oh goodness, oh my. It tells you to um, take the second dose before 4 p.m. And it is Christmas Eve. And I love my tree, and I've been eyeing it for a couple weeks, making plans for when it's time to take it down. I'm going to be doing a hard edit of my ornaments because I have a lot of very beautiful ones. I made a bunch of these in the 90s. Yeah, I have a bunch of these. But these and these that that all three of those those are part of the white family ornaments from Liberty and I have a whole bunch more that I didn't put up that are like little wooden like I think these are from the white family but I have a whole bunch of wooden ones that came from Howard Brand Discount in Liberty back in the 80s. So I'm going to do a hard edit and divide those up to share with my siblings because I don't need this many ornaments. Even, even stuff like this. I love these owls, but I've got like six of them. I don't need that many. So I need to... Um, pare them down because nobody needs that many ornaments although I'm grateful for them and I think they're beautiful but there's the puppy dog on Christmas Eve she we may go look at Christmas lights tonight because I just don't get out at all when I work from home and then again being sick lately I, I can't even go anywhere I'm so dizzy with these meds but I'm hoping we can get out and go look at Christmas lights. But look at these. I got both of these at a party. And one just shakes his booty and the other kind of literally does a shuffle. And this is something me and my mom made back in the early 90s. These ornaments we made for the Victorian Christmas tea at our church. But we made extra for us, and so here's a picture of the tree that we put them on. Can I get a better picture? Yeah, I think you can see them on there. We even had little sachets. I put that out at Christmas time. And my British ornaments I didn't fully take down last year. I can't reach them. But let me brag on my sister. That is a um, sketch drawing that my mom did, I don't know, late 80s, early 90s. We have a sketchbook of a few of these things. See, she signed it. And my sister had the beautiful idea to pull those out and get them professionally framed. I got one and my brother got one. And I've got it hung up. It was a very nice gift. Good job, sissy. Oh, the doggy got a stretch. She's going to stretch. I'm, oh, I'm not coughing at this moment. I'm not coughing. Ain't that a good girl? Have you been a good girl today? Yes, she has. It's not time. 
it's almost time but let me head back and go get my second dose <laughs> hopefully you won't hear the buzz saw going on in the next room hopefully there's nothing untoward in my bedroom there's my snoopy tree I brought this in here because it was in the way at Christmas time. Isn't this beautiful? Mrs. Hilton gave me that for Christmas. We love cardinals. And I love that it's sitting on a snowy pine cone. That's my Snoopy tree. Didn't make up my bed. Sorry. <laughs> anyway, here's my pills. So, y'all have a wonderful Christmas Eve. Bye.